team. At center, 6'11", number 33, Nicholas. Forward, 6'5", number 95, DeAndre Pickery. And guard, 6'5", 13, James. Sports. Get ready for some NBA action. Our broadcast team tonight, on one side, Greg Anthony. On the other side, Steve Smith. And on the sideline, David Aldridge. I'm Kevin Harlan. Hey, Dave. Thank you, Kevin. Last season, James Harden moved past Larry Bird on the career points list. Harden said, passing one of the greatest ever is a great honor. I just got to continue to build because at the end of the day, I want my name to be mentioned with those greats. Well... It already is. Guys? I agree, David. Every word of it. Absolutely. Thank you. And let's see what the Nets have coming up. On Tuesday, they'll face off against DeAndre Jordan and the Los Angeles Lakers. Then on Wednesday, they'll be matching up with Nikola Jokic and the Denver Nuggets. And for their matchup with Phoenix, uh, this is what the fans have been wanting to see. Two of the best teams in the league duking it out and and you know whoever gets the win is going to be viewed as the team to beat here are the starters for los angeles the two mega stars are the big men lebron and davis avery bradley is out there with russell westbrook and it's a reason in at the three the small forward and for the nets harden out there with irving then there's edwards and it's Bembry in at the three slot for the teams that are clearly rebuilding Greg, should they simply play the young guns uh, no matter what, or, or should they make them earn their minutes? I think there should be a combination, and, and as long as guys are pros and really approaching the game the right way, you want to give them an opportunity to grow, and also it gives you a chance to evaluate. Now here's Harden, pocket six. From downtown, Ariza with the rebound. Outside, Davis, and the whistle blows. It's going to be on DeAndre Bembry. That's his first foul. Outside, Brent. Back to Westbrook. Banked in off the glass. Westbrook. Westbrook's got the scoreboard going with his first points of the night for the Lakers. The best to Bembry. To the paint. And stolen by James. Now here's Bradley, the fast break opportunity. And it's slammed in by Davis. What a beautiful play. And it was great timing. Then the athletic finish by AD. Westbrook against Harden. And Davis pulls it down. Meeting right at the rim. He typically converts in those situations. Not this time. Poked away. Here's Bembry. He's covered by Westbrook. Bembry kicks to Harden. Shot clock at five. No one near Edwards as he lets it fly. Trains it from beyond the arc. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Bounce pass from Westbrook. 
Davis down low. Right now, checking his stats, he's averaging over 23 points a game. Now here's Harden. And he lobs it up toward the rim. They now take the lead. And arguably no one in the NBA draws more attention than Harden. Part of why I think he creates so many opportunities for others. Now here's Bradley. And looking at his production, he averages a little more than seven points a game. Back to Ariza. Cans the shot from the wing. How about three or four from the floor to start? That's always a good sign. Here is Harden. Last game we saw him score 13. Now Irving. Misses that one. He's 0 for 1 from the floor. I like it. That's a great battle at the rim. He just couldn't finish. And this, the second season of Anthony Davis's five-year, $190 million extension. And he admitted that with his injury history, that long-term security was a consideration. Now here's Bradley, the fast break opportunity. He dishes it to LeBron. The kick out to Westbrook. Good on the triple. Westbrook. Westbrook's got his second bucket of the night. And AD's injury woes rearing their head last season as well, Greg. We saw it missing a number of games. Well, a, a big man with his athleticism, a lot of stress on the legs. LeBron's gotten him on the same nutrition and treatment regimen. Hopefully, that'll help. Score it. His third straight basket in three tries. It's simple. If you get open, LeBron will find you. The king is an incredible passer. Passes it to Harden. To stop the run. And Harden with the stop. <laughs> Ducks aren't always for the big foul. A serious power move from the point. Forget just landing in. He wanted to make a statement. And the foul called on Anthony Davis. That is his first foul of the game. And now another look at that mobile one block defensive performance. And, and making a statement right away. Letting them know they won't get any easy ones when he's around. against LeBron. Pass to Irving. The three. Avery Bradley applying the heat. You can see why he's been first team all defense. Here's Davis. The kick out to Westbrook. Bradley deciding where to go with it. In the corner it's James. Trying to get open it's Davis. The kick out to Westbrook. Six to shoot. Tries again. And it's off the back rim. No good. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D out of position, you can see the frustration on his face. Back to Edwards. Pass to Harden. Here's Irving. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. You look at Kyrie's shot chart. He's terrific for mid-range. Down low. Here's Davis. Brooklyn with the rebound. Offensively, that's how you want to end the possession. Except for the result. Edwards passes to Claxton. Westbrook against Harden. Can't tie it up as that one's no good. The will is there, but the execution is lacking. He can't seem to finish plays this quarter. It's going to be out of bounds. Los Angeles will retain possession. Brooklyn on defense. 
trailing by two. Here's LeBron. Uses the glass to finish the lane. There's almost no stopping LeBron. He muscles his way right through contact. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Harden bounce pass. Irving kicks to Edwards. There's the pass to Harden. Down to five on the shot clock. And the foul on Harden. That's his first foul. Oh, great defense there. Anticipated the play and got there first. And Brooklyn making a change here. Mills is checked in. And the Lakers also making a change. Anthony's checked in. James with it. And get a load of his scoring totals. Huge numbers for him. An average of just about 29 points a game. And this is year one of LeBron's two-year $85 million extension. And Greg, that will take him through age 38. And that will amount to $435 million in career earnings. The most all-time. And it wouldn't surprise me if he's got a few more years left in the tank after that. First free throw is good. And really, is there anything LeBron can't do? One of the most versatile players the game has ever seen. Marcus Aldridge has checked in for Nicholas Claxton. Horton Tucker's checked in for the Lakers. Malik Monk comes in for Avery Bradley. So he gets them both. Nets trail by six. And here is Irving. Last game with 30 points. Driving to the basket. And yes, it's good. Cutting to the rim with force. Once Kyrie sees an opening, he seizes it. LeBron outside. No good. And it's the Nets taking it the other way. They went to Los Angeles for their last meeting with the Lakers and came out with a victory. And really brought an impressive physicality to that matchup, drawing a ton of fouls and, of course, went on to win it. They forced the issue and made the defense hack them to death last game. I'm sure they'll try to mirror that same attack in this one. Mills passes to Aldridge. He kicks it to Irving. The Lakers with the rebound. Now the Lakers on the break. Here's Anthony. And the shot is long. And the foul called on Russell Westbrook. That's his first foul. So for the Nets, Griffin comes in for Edwards. And Thomas subbed in for Bemper. And the Lakers also making a switch. Howard's checked in. game for the Lakers that was a loss to the Heat in Miami. Yeah, I mean, on the road, tough environment. They were right there, but just missed some key shots. And you know, so often, that's what it comes down to. Who can convert when it matters most? Shots good by Mills. Not the most natural ball handler. This is what Mills prefers to do. Catch and shoot. Releases from 15. Westbrook, no good. It's a shot you would think he would make, but he just doesn't make it all the time. Here's Irving, and misses it off the right side of the rim. Very dangerous to leave a guy like that open. Lucky break there for the deep. Monk dishes to Carmelo. Over Thomas. Los Angeles with another miss. Brooklyn trailing. Irving looking for an opening. Now here's Mills. He had a 21-point outing in their last game against Minnesota. Just five to shoot. On its way from Irving for two. No luck that time on the shot that would have put them on top. Inside. They need this one. That's good from Howard on the assist by Anthony. And the Lakers lead by three. And like Shaq in the past, it, it takes a ton to stop Howard 
on these shots. Simply bodying him sometimes isn't enough. Now here's Griffin. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. Here's Irving from deep. Thomas. Westbrook pulls it in. And right from the start, Kevin, they've been pounding the glass. Most of those 50-50 balls also go in their way. And it's Howard finishing it off. And love how Howard throws it down. Just spectacular to watch on these alley-oops given his strength. Floats one up. Mills can't hit. And here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. It's a five-point game. Brooklyn's gone two or five from three-point land here in the first quarter. Westbrook against Irving. Passes to Aldridge. Shoots a fader, and he gets the bucket. Big men who can score inside and out. Difficult to find. L.A., one of the most prolific. Westbrook passes to Howard. Here's Horton Tucker. Covered by Irving. Westbrook scanning the floor. Over Mills. Westbrook can't get it to go. Decent look for mid-range, but there may have been a better option for them in that set. Griffin's shot is off. And I'm sure next time he sits down, coach is going to have a few choice words for him with that shot selection. And you know what? He knows it. You have to try to play within the system or you're going to come away with empty possessions. Now, here's Monk. No points in the game yet for him. Westbrook, no good. Nets trail by three. On the wing, Irving. Kicks to Griffin. To the middle. And it's sent back by Howard. Yeah, and she you have to be cautious with Howard around. He has such a long reach that he blocks those kinds of shots. Los Angeles making a switch here. Reeves is checked in. Thirty-two seconds left in the first quarter. Just two to shoot. Mills can't hit. And he's a good shooter from outside, but not sure from that deep. You know, we're seeing players move further and further back to create space, but that does make it a tougher shot. Now, here's Monk. They look to him for part of their offensive attack. Right now, he averages nearly 12 points a game. Los Angeles needs to get off a shot here. And again, no good by the Lakers. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. Lakers lead by three. 2K Sports back in a moment here in Brooklyn. Well, Kyrie Irving at 6'3", one of the most creative finishers in the NBA. He details where it all started. I just go back to being in my backyard and, you know, just practicing all my layups or all my finishes. You know, that's what I go back to. I mean, this is when I'm in that situation. I kind of feel like the attitude I give. This is what I do. Well, it is indeed the English the angles. He is a magician out there, Greg, with the ball in his hand. And his godfather, Rod Strickland, another New York point guard legend who was known for his improvisational finishes. Kyrie had it from the soil. And if you're just tuning in, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from the Lakers here so far, guys. Well, they used the fast break to generate some easy buckets before the defense could get set. You know this, the team that dictates the pace typically rules the roost. We see that here early on. 
And now, brought to you by Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset our lineups. Setting the four for the Nets. We've got Thomas. Mills out there with Kyrie Irving. Then there's Griffin, and it's Aldridge in at the center position. Reeves can't hit. The Nets shooting about 35% from the floor. Not much falling for them. Mills, and he uses the glass on the lane. Mills has got seven points in the game. You see Griffin keeping his eyes up, looking for a hole in that defense. Howard against Aldridge. With the drive, the shot's good from Monk. And giving up some inches inside, but makes up for it with an aggressive style. And that takes skill and the ability to make adjustments as you're going up. Now, here's Irving. He seems to always be finding ways to score, averaging around 23 and a half points a game. Mills, that's a two-pointer, and it's sent back by Howard. They recover it. Here's Irving. Misses off the left eye. Lakers have gotten only one of their first four shots in the second quarter to drop. Johnson, the pass to Horton Tucker. Here's Howard. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. It's on LaMarcus Aldridge. And we all know that star players get a few more perks, but Greg, that can also stir up misgivings in a locker room when things aren't always equal. Kevin, it's a great point, and, and coaches really have to be careful. If you're holding one player accountable and giving another a pass, that tends to lead to a fractured locker room. First one falls. And Howard may be the most physically imposing player in the game today. His strength still sets him apart. Looking at who's out there now for the Nets. Nicholas Claxton comes in for LaMarcus Aldridge. And it's Harden in for Kyrie Irving. The Lakers also changing it up. Trevor Ariza's checked in for Taylor Horton Tucker. And Bradley's subbed in for Malik Monk. Nets trail by three. Okay, well, let's check in with David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sidelines. Thank you, Kevin. Well, the Brooklyn Nets are creating a fresh legacy. Kevin Durant says it's new energy. We're one of the first teams in Nets history where fans are expecting us to do good things. Basketball culture is deep in Brooklyn, and they're looking for a team to latch on to. Well, guys, it looks like they found a good one. I agree, David. Thanks. And you look at the stats, Howard's at his best in the pick and roll. Thomas passes to Harden. Going inside, and Harden with the stuff. Never a bad idea to run the old pick play. Uh-uh, you're right. And if it produces a slam like that, you'll probably see more of them. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. Have to switch on that play. Now, here's Ariza. Shot clock at six. And here's Bradley from three. And out of bounds as the Nets gain possession. Edwards, he's checked in for Brooklyn. DeAndre Bembry comes in for Patty Mills. Davis is checked in for the Lakers. And the Nets with possession here. Only giving up six here in this quarter. Pass to Harden. Ball's knocked loose. And the ball's tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Knocked away. It's the Nets now. Six on the shot clock. Takes a three. Hands it from downtown. Harden's got the lead up to two now for Brooklyn. So lethal from beyond the perimeter. Harden is smart at recognizing when he should shoot from there. Ariza, right side. Here's Davis. Brooklyn with the rebound. Coming off that loss against the Timberwolves. Well, when you're facing a team that's feeding off the crowd's energy, 
you have to bring your A game, and they didn't do that defensively. It looked like there were communication breakdowns all night. Deadly, especially when you're on the road. Now here's Davis. And they double up Davis. Here's Reeves. Ariza outside. Pass to Reeves. From 15 feet away, it's hauled in by Claxton. And when you can't get anything to fall, it definitely gets in your head. And his rhythm has been way off. The goal now might be to get him something easy at the rim so he can just see the ball go in through the net, and that helps. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Davis surveying the floor. Here he goes. Misses and the dry spell continues. The struggle is real. He's been way off with his shot all evening long. Here's Reeves. Oh, and he pucks it off the glass. Wow. Ariza against Harden, and he converts the layup. Now it's a six-point Nets lead. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for Brooklyn. They're doing a great job defensively down low. They've already racked up a lot of blocks. They've established an intimidation factor early in this one. And also, they've been really active on the defensive end in terms of applying the pressure and coming away with steals. Good open look. Avery looking poised with the ball in his hands, making decisions. Harden dishes to Thomas. Here's Bembry. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. He takes it in. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got his fifth rebound in this one. A three from Brantley. Rebound, Brooklyn. Claxton's got four rebounds now tonight. Harden kicks to Thomas. Here's Claxton. He's guarded by Johnson. Harden lets up. And Thomas now, top of the key. Offline with his three. Lakers trail by four. The pass to Reeves. Right side Davis. Pass to Reeves for the three. Rebound, Brooklyn. outside score the basket it's number six for him this game six for nine 67 percent shooting and the D has to be more aware of hard especially when he's operating that close to the basket now here's Bradley he had a 15 point outing in their last game against the Heat in Miami here's Reeves over Harden. Reeves can't hit. It's almost as if there's a lid on the hoop for him right now. He still hasn't gotten one to fall in the quarter. Here's Harden. Pass to Claxton. Here's Bembry. Reeves are covering. The tray. And James Harden hits from deep. Harden's got the lead up to nine now for the Nets. His shot making has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. So the Lakers call timeout their first. One of the stories here, James Harden getting it done today. This guy is killing you, and so far I haven't seen a good adjustment defensively. against LeBron. Outside Brent. This one for three. 
The rebound by the Nets. And on an open look like that, he's very gifted at making the weak coverage pay. Harden the pass to Thomas. Here's Claxton. Looking at his numbers, he averages a bit over nine points a game. Five on the clock. And there's the call on James. That's his first foul. Well, he bailed him out with that one. The shot clock was low. You got to just play straight up D. That is not the time to take a foul. The Nets making a switch here. Irving's checked in. Malik Monk, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Here's Edwards. Off target there. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. James misses. Nets leading by nine. Here's Bembry. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. And the foul on Carmelo Anthony. That's his first foul. Marcus Aldridge has checked in for Brooklyn. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. Horton Tucker's checked in for Davis. Harden against Westbrook. Harden dishes to Edwards. Lock at six. Irving for three. Monk grabs the board. Frozen. The guy is just ice cold, unable to contribute offensively. And the call will be against LaMarcus Aldridge. That'll be his second foul of the game. Harden against Westbrook. And something that Harden continues to work on. Now, that kind of defensive effort makes his coaches and teammates proud. Pass to Irving. Over Westbrook. Irving can't get it to go. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Here's Westbrook. Another miss, and they desperately need a bucket. And James picks up the foul. That's foul number two for him. I, I mean, I like the call. I thought the defense was just there a little late. And the Nets making a change here. Griffin's checked in. Brooklyn leading by nine. Al Harden. He's got 16. On deep. They get the rebound. And the slam by Blake Griffin. The incredible energy of Blake Griffin. Skilled at sticking with plays and finishing them off. Here's Westbrook. Another miss by Westbrook. You like that he's still attacking, but the results tonight just haven't been there. And now in the second half of his career, Russell Westbrook wants rings. He knows he's getting older and has no time to waste. It's why he plays with such passion. Six to shoot. Irving passes to Aldridge. And the dunk by Aldridge. Running the pick and roll to perfection. Kyrie with a great feel for the game. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. And good that time. LeBron's got his second bucket tonight. And Westbrook's high motor is why we love him. He goes out, Greg, and competes every play in every game. Uh, no doubt, but I tell you what, he's tired of missing out on the NBA Finals. This is a guy that is hungry to get back to that stage. It'll be interesting to see if he can get it done. Westbrook finds James. Driving in. And the rebound goes to Griffin. Griffin's got his fifth rebound in this one. A good board there, Kevin, but overall they're getting slightly out-rebound. Now Monk following the three-point attempt by Kyrie Irving. A three ball. The shot by Monk is no good. Now eight seconds separate in the two clocks. Griffin dishes to Irving, looking to get back on track here, and he drops that one in. Irving's got the lead up to 13 now for the Nets. And it seemed like they couldn't get anything to fall in that opening quarter, but you can just feel the momentum starting to shift. And it's sent back by Aldridge. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Aldridge.
15 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. The shot's good from LeBron. The indestructible one. LeBron brushing off contact with an easy deuce. Irving with the ball. Over Anthony. And the last shot at the buzzer doesn't go in for him. That'll do it for the first half. It's the Nets. They're up by 11. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Hey, Kevin, thanks. Hey, James, we know that scoring seems to come easy for you. How do you create that mentality out there? I just like to have fun. You know, it's all for the kids. It's all for the fans. You know, I think that's what we're here for. And so, uh, you know, guys, just go out there and compete, have fun, and just play hard. My family doesn't think it's all for the kids, but I appreciate your sentiment. Back to you, Kevin. <laughs> All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, welcome back to 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson alongside Shaquille O'Neal and the Jet, Kenny Smith. Let's get to it. James Harden led the way in the first half. He had 16 points, four rebounds, and two assists. And he wasn't himself in that last contest, but tonight, he's really turned it around. Shaq, let's get your take on Brooklyn. It's been a surprising first half. They were big the dogs coming in, and they didn't play like that. They were not intimidated. They came out playing like they were supposed to. That's how you gotta play. You need to continue that mindset if they want to keep making it happen. And Kenny, let's get your thoughts on the Lakers. They wouldn't be in such a deep hole if they hadn't given up so many offensive rebounds. Getting out hustled, getting moved around, losing possession. The one thing you can control is effort. And that's going to do it for us here. The second half of action is coming your way. got a second half of basketball for you. We think it's going to be pretty good. A big comeback, though, is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. A fantastic game from Harden in this one. Yeah, and just look at the numbers from the first half. He has been very efficient, and it's not like everything's been at the rim. There's been a number of jump shots along the way. And with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. Taking a look at Los Angeles, the two megastars are the big men, LeBron and Davis. Avery Bradley is out there with Russell Westbrook, and it's Ariza in at the small forward position. And Trevor Ariza is going to pick up a foul here. That's his first foul. Let's take another look at the staunch defense during that mobile one block. And boy, did he get up quick to reject that shot. That's as fundamental as defense gets. Irving against Bradley. Now the pass to Edwards. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That's his third personal team second. The Nets shooting their first free throws with the Nets right here. At the line, two times. He throw good, Edwards. And Edwards drops him both. Lakers trail by 13. LeBron outside. 
deft touch on the alley-oop. Oh, what a pass. And then he lays it in with the circus move. Mm, so smooth. Martin outside. Back to Irving. Shoots over breath, and it's good off the back of the rim and in. Irving's got eight points. When we talk about guards in the NBA, Kyrie is the best finisher in the paint. Westbrook kicks to LeBron over Edwards. That is good. And the Nets' lead is cut down now to just 11 on the bucket from LeBron. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Now, here is Irving. Eight points for him. Oh, he is saying, come out and find me. Kyrie from well beyond the arc. For three, Westbrook connects from three-point range. He's got ten. Three straight to begin this half. Couldn't have drawn it up any better. It's Harden with the drive and easy two points on the layup. And the Nets lead by 13. An elite scorer who takes pride in torching defenses. Hart is outstanding at getting to his spots and capitalizing. Now here's Davis. Six points for him. James, the pass to Davis. Yes, and it's LeBron picking up the assist. Davis has got four points in the quarter. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. Passes it to Irving. Over Bradley. Here's Benbury. And the Nets, another three. They couldn't have asked for a better start to this half. Offensively, four straight and counting. Pass to LeBron. It's tipped. Outside Edwards. Again, the Nets for two. Wow, five straight buckets coming out of half. They are rolling. LeBron kicks to Westbrook. Another steal. Lost to Irving over Davis, and Davis sends it back. The combination of agility and reach makes AD a lethal defender. Capable of sending shots back from anywhere. Now here's Irving. Just five on the clock. Claxton no good. Here's Westbrook. He gets that one to drop. He's now five of 12. Savvy ball movement by Anthony Davis. Making good use of his floor vision. He locks up the alley-oop pass. Up high to stuff the alley-oop. Oh, such a beautiful pass to set that one up. Yeah, the pass might have been pretty, but the finish was angry. <laughs> now, here's James. Ten points for him. And the pass to Davis. Back to LeBron. Over Irving. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. LeBron's got four points this quarter. It doesn't take much for LeBron to get going, which is what makes him so intimidating. And the first timeout call to the game for Brooklyn. Steve, you played four years at Michigan State with all the changes, including pro options for the top prospects. Do you worry at all about the college game? No, I don't worry about it. In some ways, having more players who stick around is a good thing. But I love the opportunity these young guys are getting. Continuity can lead to beautiful basketball. They just have to make adjustments. Thomas checked in for Irving. The Lakers also with a sub. Johnson's checked in. And the Nets with possession here. Edwards, that's good. Yeah, how about the percentage they're shooting from beyond the arc here in the second half? Outside Westbrook, he kicks it to a reason. And he drives in. Here's Davis. Count it. Number five from the floor this game. He's now five of 11. The contact there can't stop AD. 
His size helps him get to his shot. Westbrook with the steal. And here we go with Westbrook running it up the court. Ariza outside. Passes it to Johnson. Outside Bradley. Trying to find Davis. He's got it now. Shot clock at six. Another shot, and that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. The absolute fearlessness. It's why we love Westbrook. Just getting after it and drawing the contact. And let's take a moment, guys, to get your take on the scoring so far for the Nets. They've turned in a fantastic performance from three-point range. That's been a weapon for them all game. And I also two. love the way they move the basketball. Their passing has been outstanding here in the second half. The free throw drops for Russell Westbrook. The former MVP, the hunger and energy Westbrook plays with each and every night is downright infectious. And both free throws good for Westbrook. And it's Harden with the ball for the Brooklyn Nets. 13-point lead. Thomas with the ball. Westbrook picks him up. Out of bounds. Next ball as Brooklyn keeps possession. Brooklyn. Howard against Edwards. Five to shoot. High arcing shot. Reeves the pass to Westbrook and stolen by Thomas. Rebounded by the Lakers. Howard's got six rebounds in the game. Got a piece of it. Thomas with the ball. Picked up by Davis. With the shot. And Harden gets it to go in on the assist by Thomas. Harden's got four points now in the quarter. So reliable. They've really leaned on him at the offensive end. Westbrook double team. Pass to Howard. Johnson surveying the floor. Five on the clock. Back to Howell. Outside Westbrook. From deep three-point range, it's hauled in by Claxton. Claxton's got five rebounds tonight. Oh, he's going up for the alley-oop here. Oh, I love that dish down low. Lakers trail by 17. Howard, the pass to Reeves. Popped up there for Howard. And he lays in the alley-oop. And Howard values shots from there. He makes these all the time, and the D has to get up in his face. Thomas passes to Harden. My goodness, how about that miss? I mean, that's two easy points that they've just given away. And it's tonight. Thomas. Harden outside. And Davis sends it back. Here's Reeves. He's guarded by Thomas. Reeves gets the bucket. I mean, if the defender is going to play off like that, then you know what's going to happen. There are going to be points put on the board. Pass to Thomas. From deep. Nailed from three-point land. Thomas got five points so far. And they have been relentless from deep. And you see the defense trying to react, but to no avail. You know what? They talked about this at halftime. And they're doing a better job of creating space. A 
Los Angeles calls timeout. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, these guys need to work together as a team, as a unit. Try and carve out some easy buckets. Changes for Brooklyn. LaMarcus Aldridge has checked in for Nicholas Claxton. Blake Griffin comes in for DeAndre Bembry. And it's Mills in for James Harden. Here's Horton Tucker. He is still scoreless so far in this one. Anthony, the pass to Horton Tucker. Outside Westbrook. Kicks to Howard. On deep. The shot comes out. And it's the Nets taking it the other way. Thomas against Westbrook. Bounce pass, Thomas. Aldridge, the pass to Thomas. Let's the three fly. Monk grabs the board. Monk's got his fourth rebound in this one. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And last year, Carmelo Anthony climbed into the top 10 all-time in score. Well, I mean, he's a surefire Hall of Famer. And he may never get that NBA title, but you factor in college and international play, and it, there's no doubt he'll be in Springfield. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. LeBron's checked in for Dwight Howard. Both free throws good from Anthony. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. Now here's Mills. Seven points in the game. Griffin looking it over. There's the drive. Up and in on the layup. Griffin's got his second bucket. You have to be a solid defender with Blake Griffin. You can't body him up because he'll go through you. Can't give him too much room because he'll knock it down. To the inside. Here's Anthony. Good, and the assist goes to James. LeBron's got assist number five here tonight. Well, that, that's one way he can finish, but far from the only way he gets it done. He's got all kinds of tricks up his sleeve. Now, here's Thomas. Five points in the game. Stolen by Westbrook. And there's the pass to LeBron. Here's Monk. Two minutes to play. Outside quarters. Westbrook. The baseline J. Tipped away. That's leading by 14. Over to the left wing. A minute 42 left in the third. Mills finds Aldridge. Outside for Griffin. The three-pointer no good. L.A.'s on one of three from downtown since halftime. To the middle, here's Westbrook, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Westbrook's got nine points now in just the second half. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Mills passes to Aldridge. Double team on Aldridge. And here's Mills for three, trains the three-pointer. Mills has got ten. And though he's become a more complete player, Patty Mills' calling card is still the default. Westbrook passes to Horton Tucker. James against Edwards. Shot clock at five. LeBron kicks to Westbrook. Over Mills. And it's Westbrook missing. 
He looked just a little out of rhythm. He's still trying to establish consistency from there. Thomas outside. LeBron grabs the miss. James has got rebound number seven for him tonight. And Westbrook throws it down hard. And the explosiveness, incredible. I mean, Westbrook just taking off like a rocket towards the rim on these drives. Now here's Mills. Punk defending. Two points. That one goes. And not quite as aggressive from outside as they were in the first half. Sticking to the high percentage shots. Playing smart with the lead. Passes it to James. Goes up on the block. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. And the Lakers have possession. And so it's Brooklyn riding a 15-point lead at the end of the quarter. Their strategy has been clear tonight. Work the ball inside, get shots in the paint, and now they are scoring with ease. We'll return shortly. And let's take now this moment to bring up our State Farm assist of the game. And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them, and what a beautiful feat. Fundamental basketball. Keep your eyes up. Keep the ball moving. You're going to keep the defense on his heels. And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may be already out of hand. We've got Irving. Griffin is out there with LaMarcus Aldridge. And it's Mills. And it's Edwards in at the small forward. So that's the lineup for Brooklyn. Lakers trail by 15. Pass to Anthony. Back to James. Driving the lane. And it's in there. James has got the fourth quarter started here with a bucket for the Lakers. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Mills passes to Aldridge. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And not a guy you like to send to the line. LaMarcus, a terrific free throw shooter. At the line, shooting for Brooklyn. LaMarcus Aldridge. Stepping the line with two shots. Two shots. Last on the first. First free throw is good. You look at the skill, the shooting, the length. LaMarcus Aldrich is perfectly suited for today's game. Trevor Ariza's checked in for the Lakers. Second free throw, no good. And it's Anthony with the ball for the Los Angeles Lakers. Outside Bradley. Pass to Monk. Looking for Anthony and gets it there. Over Edwards. Rebounded by the Nets. Just over a minute played here in the fourth. Kept alive, Aldridge. And the layup's good off the glass. And the Nets lead by 16. A terrific offensive rebounder. Aldridge definitely knows what to do with it when he gets it. Here's Anthony. That one a tad offline to the right, but drops in for him. And after an abysmal 
first half from the field. The shots now starting to fall. Mills passes to Irving. Outside for Griffin. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Irving's got his fourth assist in this one. No hesitation from Blake on that catch and shoot jumper. James finds Anthony. To the paint, here's Monk. Up and in with the jumper near the hoop. One sign of a great playmaker hitting his man in stride. That's leading by 15. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. The pass to Griffin. Down low. Here's Aldridge. He's been up and in off the pretty assist. And that's now nine points for Aldridge. Great concentration by Aldridge. Lots of heat on him in there. Doesn't matter. Monk kicks to Brantley. LeBron James on the wing. Wide open look. Again, Los Angeles. And it's the versatility. No matter what LeBron concentrates on, it's possible he could lead the league in that. Now a timeout call by Brooklyn. And as fans and broadcasters, we're not permitted to hear the specifics in these huddles. No, we're left to infer from the adjustments we see on the floor. Nicholas Claxton's checked in for Aldridge. And DeAndre Bembridge subbed in for Blake Griffin. Davis has checked in for the Lakers. Okay, well, let's go down to David Aldridge for a report from the sideline. Hey, guys. During the last break, I heard Steve Nash talking to his team. He talked about the mindset they need to have and what he wants to see the rest of the way. Engagement at both ends and making good decisions with the ball. Guys? Okay, David, thanks. Here's LeBron. Following the basket by Kyrie Irving. Bradley drives in. Dishes it to Monk. Six to shoot. Puts it up. Los Angeles keeps it going. A new 14-second shot clock. Nets leading by 17. Outside Irving. And off the left side of the rim, and it swirls in for it. And watching that defensive effort right there, you wonder how much they want this game. They are getting bared tonight with plays like that one, allowing too much space for a good shooter. Back to James. Passes it to a reason. Trying to find Davis. He's got it now. A nice, silky finish on the alley-oop from the stupendous feet. That sequence couldn't have been executed any better. Now, here's Mills. Defense right on him. And the rejection by James. Great positioning by LeBron and timing on that block shot. Plenty of daylight on that shot. Wow, what a pass there. He made that a very easy basket with that setup. Pass to Claxton. Back to Irving. Here's Claxton. He's guarded by Davis. Mills, that's a two-pointer. A rebound by the Lakers. Monks got his sixth rebound on the night. Pass to James. Makes that one fall. It's his eighth bucket in 15 shot attempts. And you got to appreciate just the presence of mind there. Monk demonstrating solid court awareness by finding the open man. Now here's Mills. And it comes off the front of the rim. Missed opportunity. It's a makeable shot for him. He just can't get it to go. Moving against a reason. James gets to a reason. It's Davis on the wing. And Patrick Mills gets that whistle that time. That's foul number two for him. 
for James Harden. He's checked in for Brooklyn. The Lakers also with a sub. Russell Westbrook's checked in for Malik Monk. Westbrook against Harden. Westbrook, no good. Nets leading by 13. Harden the pass to Edwards. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. That's on LeBron James. At the line. And out the line. Shooting two. And he makes the first. And Edwards drops him both. And they're doing a better job of working themselves to the line here in the second half. Now LeBron. Irving with the steal. And now the fast break. Edwards with the ball. Harden outside. And there's the pass to Irving. Six on the shot clock, and he's going up for the alley-oop. It's stolen by Bradley. Ariza has the open look, and he's good on the three ball. Such an accurate shooter off the pass. Ariza, a quick thinker who, who knows he can score in those situations. Irving passes to Harden. Inside, here's Claxton. Marvelous lead pass, and he throws it down. Ooh, a little extra on that one. He does. He doesn't usually finish soft either. Obviously, he can when necessary, but not that time. Westbrook. Oh! oh. And there's the ferociousness. Got to enjoy Westbrook taking flight and slamming it down there with authority. Defense doesn't get much better than the mobile one block we just saw on replay. And guys, that is lockdown defense at its finest. Going right at the shot and then able to knock it away. The three from Harden. It's stolen by Davis. To the inside. Reza. Outside for Davis. It's Bradley on the wing. LeBron dishes to Ariza. Count that one. A strong Ariza. finisher around the rim. Ariza with the size to do some damage. Outside Irving. It's Harden with the drive. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Davis has got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. Feeds it to James. That's in there. Davis with the assist. Davis has got five assists tonight. Wow, he is lighting it up here in the second half. Bradley against Irving. Shoots over Bradley. And that one goes long. Lakers trail by eight. Outside Westbrook. It's Bradley on the wing. Guarded by Harden. And they double up Davis. And here's Bradley from three. Sinks the triple. Bradley's got five points now this quarter. For a guy who's much more natural shooting the long two, Bradley's worked hard to increase his range. Irving kicks to Harden. Passes to Claxton. And a wide open hook for Irving. And again, no good by Brooklyn. And so Westbrook will bring it up for the Lakers. A reason no luck. Brooklyn leading by five. Edwards looking it over. Has 
to Benbury. To stop the crowd. The putback. It's good on the putback. And the Nets lead by seven. And, and folks, he did not luck into that one. He knew just where he wanted to be to grab that backboard. James, the pass to Westbrook. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. And we've seen this before, folks. Big possession. Westbrook rising to the occasion. How about that competitiveness? To the paint. Ariza outside. He kicks it to Brandon. Fourth quarter. LeBron left side. Let's go. And it's Kyrie Irving with the rebound. Brooklyn's gone one and three from outside the arc since we reached the fourth quarter. Pass to Harden. There's 138 left in the game. And now the fast break. Westbrook with the ball. And the shot is good. Now just a two-point Nets lead. When you need a big bucket, keep it in his hands. LeBron lives for this one. Moving against Bradley. Trying to break that ice cold streak. Davis with it. Position out to Westbrook. To tie it up. Davis, the pass to LeBron. And they double up James. No one near Westbrook as he lets it go. Good, and the assist goes to James. Westbrook's got eight points in the quarter. And a moment here to take a look at some hustle stats for the Lakers. Contested shots and block shots. That's been their bread and butter defensively, giving up no easy looks. Yeah, but also, they haven't missed a beat in terms of their fast break game. That's been equally as effective all night long. Timeout called the Lakers. They're trailing by one. 50 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Coming out to the court. Come on. Get loud for your Brooklyn Nets. the New Balance player of the game, Russell Westbrook. Hey, Kevin, it's a no-brainer. He's controlled every aspect of this game, and it's just so fun to see a player perform at a level that's just higher than anyone else out on the floor. And the Lakers making a change here. Anthony's checked in. Seven seconds left to play here in the fourth. That's tipped. And on the way from Irving for three. Another miss by Irving. And they had some boxed coverage that turned into no coverage. Bradley dishes to Davis. Here's the pass to Westbrook. Over Harden. A second chance effort. Great tee that time for Edwards. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now. Again and again, they're not in the penalty yet. Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. 17 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And an intentional foul right there. 15. At the line, shooting for Brooklyn. Kyrie Irving. At the line, two times. He drops the first one, and that will put them up by two. If you're looking for entertainment, you've come to the right place. Kyrie puts on a show every night. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a three-point game. Yeah, how about the nerves there? Those free throws put them in a very good position. Three points clear. And the Lakers call time here. They're behind by three. 16 seconds left in the fourth quarter. What do you think, guys? And it's do or die time. They need a bucket.
talking here to stay alive. Also interesting choice to be made right here. You need either a three or a quick two and a five. Outside Brantley. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Hard-nosed guy. Avery plays with no fear. Nice job of drawing contact. Good on the first, and that brings them within two here. A lot to like about Avery Bradley's game. Terrific on-ball defender, solid spot-up shooter, and will get you some boards as well. And the second free throw, no good. A tough break there. And they need to stop the clock, so there's a foul. No choice but to foul there, but, but he's probably the last guy you want to see on the line. At the line, Kyrie Irving stepping the line with two shots. So the first one drops, and that makes it a three-point lead. So he gets them both, and it's a four-point ball game. Big moment at the line. As poised as you get, this thing is done. And a deep three from Westbrook. No good. And so it's Brooklyn who scrapes by with the win. Probably a little closer than they would have liked it, but a win nonetheless. Yeah, but I really got a sense that the fans gave them that emotional boost that was needed down the stretch. This crowd, man, they were electric. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much, James. You have seen every type of defense from opponents over the years. What do you enjoy about that back and forth challenge? Just every single game, I'm trying to figure out what they're doing and how can I uh, be aggressive and attack it. You know, I love playing a game of basketball. I love you know, being crafty and, and just trying to compete at a high level every single night. You know, it takes a lot, but I'm built for it and uh, I'm going to just continue to keep going. Well, you won the chess match tonight, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you. David, thank you as always. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Greg Anthony, David Aldridge, Steve Smith, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. So long and good night, everyone.
Oh, my God.